All right, so this video is to pretty much just show how to set up a DSL service in this situation. We're starting off where the DSL service is already in place. You can see on here, it's got a solid green light. Whenever you have a solid green light, that lets you know that you have what they call sync to the DSL modem. So as you can see my pointer, which is just a screwdriver, but my pointer is pointing to the DSL modem. And um, it's got a plain old uh, phone line going up to our DSL circuit here. Excuse me, it's this one over here, which we've terminated. And then we've got our cabling, which goes up to our binding post. Um, at this position number 10. So what I'm going to do is I'm, is I'm just going to reverse the process so that you can uh, have an idea of what, how we got to this point. Uh, the first thing is that I'm going to remove this jack. I'll zoom in a little bit more. So that you can see the positions that I terminated it to um, is positions four and five. And uh, if you don't know your count on this particular jack, this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, this is just a standard um, jack. Um, some jacks, they, the numbering screen is a slightly little different, but most jacks will be using. Um, Wherever you see a red, it's usually position four, and the green is usually position five. Um, you also have positions um, one and two over here. For this particular um, termination, um, we are going to use four and five for red and green. Um, we've identified our circuit. The LEC in this situation gave us a circuit ID of this ARDU. See if I turn it sideways so you can see a little better out of the way. There you go. It's ARDU 3538 uh, Once I located this information, uh, this is what we call the DMARC. Uh, I was able to obtain this information from the customer who sent us out here and uh, they told me it um, was in this particular box. They told me look for position 10. And if we go a little closer, we can see the numbering scheme. Might be a little blurry. See four, see three, two, one, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Told me it's at position 10. And uh, this is just to verify that that's our circuit. Um, if it wasn't tagged, I would have had to locate this information um, and once I found position 10 I would just put my pairs this cable that comes down here I would just place one end up here position number 10 everything is in twos so you can see it a little better See how our, our yellow, blue, and our blue comes in. See coming on this side. So one goes on that one, and one goes on the one right below. Let me show you with the, I don't want to do any sparks. So, so you got the first one, and you got the second one. First one, second one. That's the pair. One goes up here, one goes here. Okay? Let me just terminate it on this side. And then I plugged our phone line in and we were able to get sync. If I did not get sync, for example, if this was flashing, um, I would have basically checked to make sure that my wire, um, which I had to strip with a wire stripper, Make sure that it, there is no uh, missing connection. Sometimes the little 
little um, silicone or plastic sleeve gets in the way of the connection or um, my copper wire here is not touching correctly or it might just be loose sometimes you may may not be able to screw it in all the way um, those are some of the easier tips to check why you didn't get sync sometimes the um, it's not properly terminated up here so I would check the wire make sure it's properly terminated uh, position number 10 up there but in this situation we had good sync um, at that point I closed up this particular jack I labeled it make sure you label it correctly get on here the ARDU 353-897 and then with a standard screw in which is um, they have mounting holes in the back and I just um, made a hole just like this screws over here put your screw in leave enough room and then just uh, pressed it in and uh, the next step now is uh, we will be contacting the customer they will test to see that they can actually see the modem we can see it physically because we're on the physical layer and um, they will 